Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Return to Monkey Island. We're in the process of trying to build our own mop and to try and get, I believe, uh, an ingredients book from here so that we can help the cook out in his kitchen. Uh, we've got the to-do list here. So yeah, we've, the quartermaster recognizes me and won't hire me, so we've got to get the bite of a thousand needles. I have no idea what that is. Uh, we've got to make the mop, find the mop handle tree, but to do that we need some wood uh, from the mop itself to give to Wally so he can make a map for us. So... <laughs> bit of a, uh, a long-winded thing to do, uh, but I also want to give a shout out just before we begin to uh, Numinous and the Egg Roll. Both of those guys have mentioned that if we hold the tab key, it actually highlights interactable items. Now, some of you guys have mentioned before that to get the full experience from this game, it's best to make sure that you really look at everything possible. So, thank you both for pointing that out, because we'll be using that a lot in the future so I don't miss anything. So, um, I guess... We tried getting the book, didn't we? But she just won't let us Can I borrow a book? Borrow it. So You never brought back the last book you borrowed. You never even apologized. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm hearing the words, but somehow they aren't helping. So I need more than that. So I'm, I'm wondering if perhaps we've obviously got to get something for her. I wonder if it's the actually the book itself. Hey, I don't think we looked at this before. Edgy. <laughs> edgy. Uh, yeah, I wonder if it's actually the book itself. And if so, I have no idea where that would be. Uh, so, that means I guess we've probably got to focus on getting the wood for the mop. Because I don't really see that we can do anything else. So, I thought maybe solving this dinner issue with the book might allow us to get some wood from the mop but unless we've got to do something else which is entirely possible uh let's just see if we can can we like distract him we can't abscond the mop can we stay away from my mop yeah we can't abs abscond the mop Ugh, i remember that stench as if it were yesterday uh so we can't do that can we potentially do anything to the mop uh, we've got coins. We tried. It's hopeless. We tried to um. Can we like cut the string? No, we can't. Appreciate it's the knife. My very own, very sharp, non-magical ceremonial knife. Okay, we've got this thing as well. The double monocle. Uh, the business card. Current times. Editor Conrad Lee. Ready to publish your unrecognized genius. I'm guessing that's going to come in handy later on. Uh, we've got a couple of different keys and things like that. We've got count the crackers. I've got enough to last me. Okay, we've got enough to last us for the time being. Uh, can we use this on the mop? Stay away from my mop. Okay, maybe, but again, he's saying to stay away from the mop, so can't do anything there for now. So I am wondering if we've got help. Ugh, there's maggots Pests there. or garnishes. A good cook sources local supplies when he can. That's actually kind of gross, mate. So. Maybe we can get another clue from this guy. Waiter, I can't understand why this is taking so long. Because it is, alright? Just bring me what the governor served me last week. Well, of course, sir. Sorry for the delay. The problem is the governor's just not helping us out. So, I mean, how else are we going to find this? Maybe we can just pay her for the book? That could be a thing, right? I don't think I've really seen... Oh, hang on. Didn't we already pick that up before? I'm sure we picked that up before. Okay, will she just take money for the book? Can I pay you for the book I lost? I don't need your money. Oh, what do you need then? <laughs> Come on. Uh, would you want a cracker? No. Can we actually ask her what she wants? I don't really have anything to say. I just like doing this. Practice no. is nice, but I'm busy these days. Governor stuff. Okay, fine. Uh, I mean, can we borrow any of the other things, or is she again going to? Gonna... Book. You never brought back the last book you borrowed. You never even apologize. So it's, it's 
I'm sorry. Yeah. It's, it's gonna be- I'm hearing the words, but somehow they aren't helping. I need more than that. Okay, so more than words. She won't take money. So, I'm literally thinking the only other thing it can be is the book itself. Now, I haven't seen the book. I can't remember if we checked the museum for the book. Maybe it could be here. There's a lot of stuff, you know, that oh, belonged to hi. us. I've got some bad news. Someone stole John Laney's iPad. No. No. <laughs> some people have no respect for private property. It must have happened right after you left. Did you see anyone on your way out? Not a soul. No, we didn't see anybody. Sorry about that. Um, really sorry to hear that that happened. Does this guy have any books? Crossword? No, as a matter of fact. I'm working on acquisition leads. The museum hasn't got a centerpiece now because someone walked away with my eye patch. Fine. I'm not sure how they got past the guard parrot, but rest assured I'll be beefing up security immediately. Good idea. Yeah, whoever it was must have been a master of disguise. Uh, meat hooks thing. I, I'm not seeing any books around here. So, I mean, we could, what was that? Oh, it's another trivia card. Nice. Okay. Let's uh, head... I mean, can we go back to the, the voodoo lady and see if maybe she's got a book? I, d I don't really know where the book would be, honestly. And that's assuming that we are looking for the book. Me again. Uh, got any other mystical advice? Got any other mystical advice or information for me? No. Oh, well, that's not very helpful, is it? Can you tell me where to find the Bite of a Thousand Needles? Can you tell needles? me where to find the Bite of a Thousand Needles? I wish I could. Me too. Yeah, me too. Uh, I guess not. Can we... Let's... I'll tell you what. Let's use the little tab thing. What's this? A frog. What's this thing? It's a forgiveness frog. When no apology will do, give the forgiveness frog. It's like a card, only much better because it's a frog. I've never huh. heard of that before. Are you sure it's real voodoo? No comment. It works. Trust me. Fine. Uh, we've had a look at these baskets and... What is this? It's a creepy shrunken head with long stringy hair. Okay, can we... Oh, we... I'll take this disgusting shrunken head. That's my last one. Quite the bargain. Okay, so we can get that. What else can we get then? All my merchandise is top shelf. Can't you at least wait until I say what I'm thinking? It's creepy. <laughs> uh, anything else? Tall bottle? I, had to, I don't know if we've looked at all practical. of these. We, we definitely... Uh, okay, can we open it? I'd need a lot of keys to open that. Yeah, we probably would. Uh, so we can probably... Well, we got the shrunken head. I'm not sure what we would use that for. It's a creepy shrunken head with long, stringy hair. Okay. So, is there anything else in here where we can say that we want it? Beats. Next time I'm in a drum circle, this would come in handy. <laughs> That's probably true. Uh, right. The statue. Right, I don't... I don't... Th Ooh, we can look at the chair, though. I've always been impressed by your chair. Thank you. Okay, nothing else to say. Uh, anything over here? Doesn't look like it. The cauldron? What's cooking? The feast of knowledge. Okay, the feast of knowledge, you say. Uh, out we go. Wally, any other ideas, man? Because we're having a, a real struggle with this. Hey, Wally. Uh, tell me again what you need. Tell me again what you need to make me a map to the mop tree. Just bring me a sliver of the wood needed to make a mop. Just a slither of the wood, okay. Bye. How are we going to get a slither of the wood? Is there anything else in here we didn't look at? I mean, I think we looked at well, most of these things, if not all of them. Okay, uh, we can't go into here. We can go back to the... Go back to the the locksmiths. What's going on in there? 
Hello, Mr. Brush. Hello. Hiya. Uh, can you help Hello. at all again? Uh, okay, we don't want another I think I'll key. Roll around a bit. Try not to touch anything. Okay. Is it this book? At the end of the plank. My mother's. Please don't touch it. What could we... I mean, I guess we could try giving her the shrunken head. have anything to say I just like doing this <laughs> practice is nice but I'm busy these days governor Stone. yeah I know do you want a shrunken head <laughs> no turns out she doesn't all right uh, I'm sort of struggling now honestly I don't I don't really know what we could could get for her. Do you guys know? Guys, not much. But be sure to come see us at the shop tomorrow. Fine. Uh, we'll come and see you at the thing. Um, I'm a little bit stuck, honestly. <laughs> Which is not a bad thing necessarily. We can't get onto there, so. So she wants. She wants something. Let's go. Let's, I'll tell you what. Let's go back and and ask her again. Let's go back and we'll see what she says. We're gonna go the long way. I said it before, but I love the way that he bounces while he's doing that. Right. So what does she say? Can I borrow a book? You never brought back the last book you borrowed. You never even apologized. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh! I'm hearing the words, but somehow they aren't helping. I need. Oh, back. I am really stupid. <laughs> we never even apologized. That was what the frog thing was, right? In the voodoo ladies. Wasn't it an apologizing frog or something? Hang on. Hang on. What was it she said about the frog? I can tell you no more. If it's forgiveness you seek, buy the frog. Fine. I'll take this forgiveness frog. It can help someone forgive even very old transgressions. Fine, there we go. It's going to be that, isn't it? Guys, I'm sorry if you were screaming at the screen. That took way too long for that to register. <laughs> right, okay. I mean, if it's not the frog, then I'm going to be bitterly disappointed. But it's, it's got to be the frog, right? It ties in perfectly. God, that, that is the, the puzzle that I've struggled with the most so far. Do you want this? This is for you. You're giving me a frog? It's a forgiveness frog. For when words aren't enough. There we go. You haven't even bothered to write anything personal on this frog. That's just rude. Oh. I reject your frog. No. Don't reject the frog. Poor frog. Right, we can write though because we've got a pen, right? Uh, dear Elaine, dear Wally, dear Carla. Dear Carla. Uh, sorry for blowing you up that one time. Sorry for forgetting your birthday. Sorry for forgetting our anniversary. <laughs> sorry for losing the book I borrowed. Sorry for losing the book I borrowed. Uh, I realise that you're tough on toughness. I admire that you are hard on softness. I value that you are dedicated to dedication. I appreciate that you're keen on bluntness. Uh, mm. I don't really know which one to use here. Uh... She is dedicated. I value that you are dedicated to dedication. Uh, as shown by your actions... Oh, God. Uh... <laughs> I, I literally don't know. Um, let's just make as one up. As shown by your actions at Port Elizabeth, please accept my humblest apology. Uh, even though it wasn't really my fault, I promise to do better in the future. I've implemented a reminder system for myself. You scared the heck out of me. <laughs> I've implemented a reminder system for myself. Hopefully that will work as this an apology. Is for you. Dear Carla, this is a nice sentiment, and it looks like you even know something about me. One thing. Ah. You can do better. I reject your frog. Oh come on! Ah, so one thing was wrong on the, 
on the list then. All right. Well, let's let's see if we can figure that out. Apparently, a forgiveness frog doesn't work if the apology you write on it isn't good enough. Okay, fine. Dear Carla. Dear Carla. Uh, the book. Sorry for losing the book I borrowed. Uh, okay, so let's I see. I value that you are dedicated to dedication. Uh, let's just choose another one As and shown see. by your actions at Santa Catalina, please accept my humblest apology. Okay, uh, I promise to do better in the future. I promise to do better in the future. Let's see how this turns out. Here we go. Fingers crossed, everyone. This is for you. Dear Carla, <laughs> this is a nice sentiment, and it looks like you even know something about me. Okay. One thing. No. <laughs> you can do better. I reject your frog. So it's going to be the the actions at, at the port or whatever, isn't it? So, okay, I wonder if there's a way that we can actually find that out. Because I guess it's not a case of, like, trial and error or blunt force. So, I don't know. That's what we'll do in the next one. We're, we're almost there, I feel. So then we'll be able to get the book and then we'll be able to cook the meal and all those things. So, uh, a little bit of progress. A lot of wandering around as well. But uh, we're getting there. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons Arcades Games, Wayne, Nate, Termini Nerdy, Paul from the Phantom Fellows, Lyle, Barry Aldridge and Hobo for all the support on the channel. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.